Hey, Mr. Ryan. You recognize that thing right there? Does that look familiar? That's the uh, $79 flux core wire welder. I was going to use my my uh, stick welder. I had to add a couple of pieces on the end of this angle iron to give me something to clamp to so I can position it. This is going to hold my wheel to retrieve my target, remember? And uh, I have to find the correct angle for the to position that wheel and then I'm going to weld it in position. And uh, so I added these on, but I went. I was going to pull out that big welder, the one that's hard to carry. It's even hard to push around on wheels. And I thought, you know, maybe I'll just pull out that that cheap little thing and see if that does the job. And it. And damn, look at that. Look at that. That's that stick welder wouldn't have done any better. Look at that. That's perfect. And even though my technique has gotten much better using the using the other welder between that and the MIG, especially doing uh, aluminum, it's definitely improved my technique, but now that I know what the heck I'm doing, this is the machine. This is this is really easy. It plugs in and it just goes. And I don't have to load the wire. They say don't leave the wire in it, but this wire's been in here for a year. It's not the original wire. But it's the wire has been in since I bought it. I swapped it right away. And they say it goes it goes bad, you'll start getting bad welds, but I'm no professional, but these welders they're definitely gonna hold. They look a lot better than they did when I started. But it's really working well and it's it's the, the setup is way easier, and anything heavier you gotta you gotta go up in power. And it's the, I'm on high, I'm on high power maximum, and I'm also at four out of ten. So I, I could push the wire a little harder, but it doesn't have the power to melt it on on this, and it wouldn't do it on aluminum. But it sure does a heck of a job on most of these things, especially tool repair. All the tool repairs I've done with this. So, thought I'd share that with you. It's just a, uh, it's a funny thing. This thing just keeps being the one to pull out. Okay, Mr. Ryan. We'll catch you later.